today we'll be sketching the graph of the parabola y equals negative 3x squared minus 6x minus 4. First, notice that since the leading coefficient is negative, our parabola will be opening down. Next, we can find the x value of our vertex, which is also our axis of symmetry, by doing negative b over 2a. This ends up giving us a negative 1, which tells us that the axis of symmetry is the vertical line x equals negative 1. We can find the y value of the vertex by plugging negative 1 back into our equation for x. This gives us that y equals negative 1. So our vertex is the point negative 1, negative 1. Here's our axis of symmetry on the graph. And then here is our vertex. Next, we can find the y-intercept by plugging in a 0 for x. This gives us y equals negative 3 times 0 squared minus 6 times 0 minus 4, which altogether gives us the y-intercept of 0, negative 4. Here it is on the graph. And then because of the symmetry of our parabola, we know that negative 2, negative 4 is also a point. Next, we can find the x-intercepts by plugging in a 0 for y. So we get 0 equals negative 3x squared minus 6x minus 4. Since it can't be factored, we have to use our quadratic formula. And here we're just plugging in all of our a, b, and c values into the equation. Now what's underneath the square root here ends up being negative. We can't take the square root of a negative, so we have no solutions here, which means we have no x-intercepts which makes sense since our vertex is down here and our parabola opens down. So now we just have to sketch our parabola.